TNT radio, good night. Well, yesterday we could listen your last album. What could you tell us about the sound of the album, the album in general terms? All right, uh, first of all, congrats to us. Congrats to us. Yesterday was the release. Um, the album, oh, Fozzy. Fozzy, sorry. The sound of the album, I would say the, the Armageddon album uh, took a bit of a darker direction. Uh, still kept all the equilibrium elements, uh, epicness, uh, mixing with the uh, folk elements, but uh, definitely a bit more aggressive, a bit more dark. Uh, more if, serious. if you will, a bit more serious, uh, less party songs, less, less drinking songs. Yeah. So as you have said in some songs like Armageddon, would you appreciate a darker sound? Um, not everything about full metal. Why this change? Well, I think it's a... First of all, uh, I must credit René because René is the one who composes the guitarist that could, fortunately could not uh, attend the show today. Uh, but I think it's uh, something that comes uh, comes in a, in a way, in a, in a natural way. It was like kind of the same, the, the next step that uh, he took as a, as a musician, as a composer, as, a, as an artist. He wanted to try new stuff and uh, I guess it was just the right time for him to come up with a bit more, uh, I don't know, mature, dark... Uh, when, we, when, we, when we talked about... The, uh, we are going to, leave to hear you. Yeah. When we talked about the album process, it was like, really told me, actually an album from album to album should be an improvement. You know, you shouldn't release a record five times, six times, seven times. And, uh, we just wanted to do something special, something different what we've done, because uh, right now, the most authentic stuff we could do is what we, or what Rene and we did on Armageddon and just what we feel right now, how we feel right now. So this is what he told me. Okay, what could you tell us about your next tour, your tour here in Spain? Uh, well, it's, uh, we're touring with uh, three more bands. Finsterfors, that's uh, another band from Germany, uh, Northgard and Heidevolk. Northgard, it's uh, Domi's band. And uh, Heidevolk, they're uh, good friends from the Netherlands, uh, also in the same genre, if you will. Uh, so we are four bands uh, touring. We will have two dates, two dates in Spain. Yeah. Madrid and Barcelona. And uh, based on uh, today's show, we are looking forward to come back. It was electrifying. <laughs> Well, officially you have a new bassist. What does he shame uh, in the sound of the band? What does he? What does he shame in the sound of the band? Well, um, honestly, nothing much since, uh, yeah, frankly speaking, Rene is the one who's uh, coming up with mostly, not mostly, sorry, everything. Uh, so we are just kind of playing the music that he writes. Uh, so when it comes to changing the direction, sound, uh, doesn't really uh, affect the music when a musician leaves or a musician comes to the band basically still keep going with, uh, with what Rene is creating so yeah so your plans for the future our plans for the future yeah uh, well when it comes to when it comes to touring and life uh, <laughs> what, what should I say we have uh, we have a few more festivals uh, we have uh, next week Summer Breeze, and then uh, we're going to Sweden, Fallon, and uh, we're playing Sabaton Open Air. It's the first time Equilibrium we'll plays in uh, Sweden, which is exciting. Uh, we might have a few more festivals uh, in, in Germany, maybe in Romania, there was some talking. Uh, we're definitely going to do the 70K, the 70,000 tons of metal in uh, February. Ooh. Hell yeah! I don't know if they told you, man, but uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm not throwing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We know, we know, we know. Yeah. We'll, yeah. we'll tell you later. <laughs> uh, we might add a few shows in uh, Mexico, US, if we're already there, but uh, that's definitely not like a sure thing. And uh, yeah, I mean, we have a kind of a rough plan for next year, but I think it's too early to talk about. So, uh, you know, keep, uh, keep up to date with us. And Check out Armageddon, which was released yesterday. Really? Really? Holy shit! We need to buy it. Yeah, we need to. Armageddon. <laughs>
So how do you feel playing here in Leyendas del Rock? How was the concert? Uh, amazing, I think. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it, right, was, right. it was, what can we say? Like, uh, we didn't expect so many people to come uh, because it's not that we played in Spain too much. Yeah. Uh, or, uh, yeah, so uh, it, for us it was a bit of a good surprise to see the attendance. The, the whole, like, the, the area was like fully packed. People uh, screaming, Domi, Domi, Hati, Hati, Hati. Uh, yeah, but the show went good. We played some uh, new songs from uh, from uh, from our Armageddon, which for, for us it's exciting, you know, to play the new stuff. And specifically today, we played for the first time Catharsis, again from uh, Armageddon. And uh, yeah, the reaction was good. We felt good. You felt good. <laughs> and uh, it was just amazing. Sonia also. Also Sonia. Ah, good. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Sonia. Yeah. So to summarize, it was epic. <laughs> yeah, exactly. it, was, it was epic. But uh, Spain is open. Every time Spain was fantastic. Yeah. So fi finally, do you want to say something to your Spanish fans and your friends from TNT? We have Spanish fans? Yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> what, shall, many fans, really. what, what shall we say? Rob, say you want to say something? You say something and then say something. Okay, <laughs> something. Something. <laughs> hey, Spanish fans, something. Uh, it was a pleasure for us to be here again. And yeah, we love to come back in on we our would love Europe. To come. We would love to well, we we love to be come, back come in back September in one or October. October. Stop the blubberness. So yeah. Spanish we'll people back. if you wanna see us again, October, September we are on European tour. Uh, we hope to see you guys. Barcelona, come Madrid. Share some love with us. Cheerio! Cheerio! Yes. Una cerveza para el favor. Por favor.